Hi team, this is Karthik from IT Learn. Um, quick note, we are towards the end of 2019 and uh, the lot we've been doing in the training segment in the software testing for the last decade. So for the existing members and new members, just want to talk about how things work um, at IT Learn. How do you get onboarded? How do you learn uh, and work with us? So let's talk very briefly about these things. The first is the membership team. So there are a lot of free content that we have, and that is a mixture of YouTube and on itlearn.com. So this gives you a great start. I know plenty of um, users worldwide who have viewed these videos and it has assisted them in their career as it is. Uh, that also gives you a comfort level as to how do we go about conducting our training programs. Then you get into our premium membership, which is a IT eLearn. This gives you access to all the 30 plus trainings that we have. In fact, I'm saying 30 plus only because I believe some of the earlier trainings that we did uh, are not completely up to date. Maybe they're two, three years old. 70, 80% of our content will be very, very up to date with what is in demand in the market. We continuously are adding new tools, uh, new skill sets to this. Um, and what I primarily wanted to say is you have access to all of this under one membership. Um, you can attend them as live or videos and all your tech support is on Skype. So we are all on Skype. We have different groups for different members, um, IT Learn member, JPAC member, and for each training and projects. Then we have the JPAC membership. Now JPAC membership has your IT Learn membership. So you have access to all those programs. Um, additionally, you will be working with us on our live real-time projects. We will also be working to get you certified strongly on both NEOT certified tester and NEOT certified developer. And what we would focus here is to do one-on-ones with you, understand you, and guide you through the training, comma, hmm. Let me wrap text somewhere. There you go. Uh, and guide you through the training, projects, resume, job process, and so on. So there's a lot of one-on-one -on -one plus group, a lot of group activities as well, team. So this includes mock interviews. This includes getting you prepared towards the program. So you have these two membership levels um, that uh, basically three, IT Learn being the first premium and JPAC. Um, there is a timing that we've kind of put. There are three months, one year lifetime access, but just consider this to be a one year membership. We want to retain with one product. That's good. Um, the JPAC is something we believe is you may need more time. It's a two years membership. Now, what does that mean? That you can repeat any time within that period so people finish some members um, learn what they need in one or two months others take um, much longer and easier so that is your approach and that is how much time you can spend depending on where you are and so on now, the same thing when we're talking about the JPAC membership here, you definitely are spending more time and yes, you'll be able to repeat as and when you want. You can attend multiple JPAC batches. Now, what is a JPAC batch team? So JPAC is the main, main training, job placement and certified training live sessions. So they consist of a group of technical uh, things. Let me talk about what, what all they consist of. So there's a lot that we will start with basics. <clears throat> That's the manual testing, manual to 
automation. Remember the one week AACT training, not one week, almost two weeks AACT training that we did. Um, that is uh, something that we start with basic. We also start talk about JPAC. What is the basics in terms of how to go about looking, um, you know, right from all the way team right from creating your project work your resume preparing for interviews what they expect uh, jpac overview this is there as a one week we did this in the last batch uh, jpac 10 uh, we didn't repeat it this batch i thought members can go through so this is these are both very very critical for the beginners now once we have gone through the basics of training uh, we are then getting into some advanced trainings. And I'll talk about the current ongoing advanced trainings team. So if you uh, always keep an eye on itlearn.com slash webinars, you would come to the, of course, redirected to this page where you have the listed webinars that are coming up team and we try and maintain it here. We are also maintaining the same thing in let me put this link in that notepad links 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 um also the google doc this google doc will be very handy for us to uh, look at the same schedule so and for any time you need to go back watch these videos then you can look at it here team so I was referring to this all about getting into QA, one week JPAC. So watch this, please. Um, there is the complete YouTube playlist and on the website where we have it. Um, then you have the ENIOT certified test of this training that was going on. So now as part of the JPAC 11 batch, there are multiple trainings that are coming to and they're all here. So at least the ones for sure that we will do right away and this is all part of the trainings so any of the it learn members can join these as well so we have um spoken about this then comes the live projects team live projects for jpac members constantly ongoing this is happening three days a week at now three days a week monday wednesday friday at 5 30 p.m pacific time and members come with project updates and present this is ongoing it is actually in fact almost completed this is with the previous jpact batch uh, we will repeat the same in this jpact batch but you have access to the previous technical interviews as well premium members um mastering as debt so this were the two sessions that happened yesterday and day before that is basically on 14th and 15th of november these were nothing but replace from an old webinar now uh, i will share those links for the same mm. day one day two there you go so that's copy link copy link address one uh where's the other one day two and two and now please note team the main training that is starting from 18th november that is my at 6 30 pm pacific time uh, this will focus very simple i will divide it into a few components so that you understand the first one week we will focus in building ddf so through ddf you'll get exposed to selenium web driver core java j unit we will install Eclipse. We will start with all those technical details and we'll also do more on element identification in here. So we're going to go deeper team. <clears throat> now, the second week, we will be building a keyword driven framework. In this, we will expose ourselves to a lot of OOPS concepts, how we go about creating a solid framework 
um, that is keyword driven. We will get into error handlings and reporting and a lot of more progress on coding that we're going to do in this team. And uh, this will be about not this is again one week and another one week we're going to talk about hybrid frameworks and complex web apps to automate. So this will also plug in any holes that we have that comes to um, uh, you know, element identifications and how the latest Selenium uh, web drivers will keep working with us and so on. So this is going to be very important for um, you the next three weeks. On the same level, in the morning, we will be this one session that Manoj did on uh, last week on Cyprus. He will be starting 18th November, but from 8.30 a.m. That way we don't have clashes. Pacific time and that's going to go on for about two weeks team. It's a new tool um, and there is a lot that Manoj is talking about how we implement it with Visual Studio, JavaScript and so on. So that is another training that is welcome for you all to attend. You don't need to necessarily attend all of them to master some. Just attend, practice, see what's happening. Now, once this is done, we will be getting into Python with Selenium and this is again being done by Manoj. And then we'll be getting into uh, CI CD. And again, for JPAC 11, we'll have the one week technical mock interviews. That kind of brings you up to placements and so on. So for the JPAC 10 batch, you've kind of mostly gone through everything. We wanted one more session here. Um, I do need one more session for any or certified training as well. The live projects are all aligned. We are meeting three times a week and you need to show updates in these projects. And uh, I think we are well aligned. Now it's just about making sure you have the right schedule. So the schedule, the dates and how those trainings are organized team, they'll all be here. So please make sure you take that from here too. Um, and there's a list here. Let me see if this list works. Mm, it's an old one. Let me put it with a new one. Um, OK, I'll update this. Uh, yes, so primarily that is what it is that we have with IT Learn team. And uh, one of the most important things is what courses can we add? We look at courses that students speak, that the industry speaks about, and what we see keep coming up regularly in the job market. Uh, so there are a bunch of courses that we want to add. Uh, we're adding Cypress.io, which is very, very popular. Web services back in testing. We'll continue to do live. HP QTP micro focus back in demand again. Uh, so definitely want to schedule some trainings there. Cucumber, Gherkins, performance testing and security testing is also something that we want to look at. And if time permits, Selenium C sharp. So with the next JPAC batch, we'll kind of repeat the same. We may retain some which are standard, which are common, and then keep changing and adding newer things to it. So that's going to be the approach. So within six months, I believe you would be exposing yourself to a lot of trainings and what is happening in the IT world constantly. We intend to do all of these live webinars. And of course, we have a good collection of library that is constantly growing. So I hope this kind of answers. I just want to make sure that um, we are all on the same page when we are talking about how we're approaching, especially with the coming uh, weeks um, towards the end of 2019. Let's get all of this in place. Great. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye all.